Disney is getting so desperate, okay? If you see what Disney's newer strategies is, okay, Disney is basically relying on two things now. Hopefully, you know, to turn this shit back around, okay? Because everything else they have tried has died, okay? It has failed, okay? Disney has killed all of their properties. So what they're doing next is they're trying to get uh, Taylor Swift fans to watch Disney+. Plus, and they're trying to get people who play Fortnite to watch Disney+. Plus. Okay, because they, cause we, we'll go over that other study, that other thing in another video. And we'll say the same things in the beginning as well. Disney is losing its audience. So Disney's trying to get a new audience to replace the old audience. Star Wars read Ewan McGregor makes desperate plea as fans for a second season of Obi-Wan Kenobi, which isn't going to happen. Because no one cares about modern Star Wars. Modern Star Wars is crap. Okay, even people who didn't really care for the old Star Wars movies feel like what Disney did to Star Wars was a complete betrayal. How is that completely possible, you may ask? Well, it's only the magic of modern Disney. The magic to turn once beloved IPs to just toxic IPs that people want to avoid. Okay, Marvel and Star Wars used to be amongst the highest grossing, most successful IPs in the world. Now they're dead. Disney has killed them. Okay, and Disney's gonna kill, it's gonna kill a lot more in the future. So, they, oh, we have the, hey, they write to Disney for a second season or so, Obi-Wan. He's begging people. For a second season of Obi-Wan Kenobi. Okay. No one's gonna watch it. Okay. You know. The six seven you really got me know I was just saying that to you before I was by it. So please, so happy. I'm just so happy to do it like the birds of prey actor continued. It was really going to be a movie, but it should be a movie. I said I kind of going that way for longer, so I hopefully it's satisfied. We'll get more screen time to leave a story. We we'll had this chance in the first season. No one liked it because it was a woke pile of garbage. You know what Disney has done to Star Wars. Okay. He is begging us for a season two to tell Disney to give us a season two. Beg us. Okay. You know, because no one wants to sell. I'm sure no one's going to beg give. Right to Disney for a second season. Okay. Disney is not going to give us a second season of Obi-Wan Kenobi. Because no one is going to watch a second season. It's that, that simple. No one cares about this TV show. And no one cares about Disney+. Plus. And it seems that these outer touch Hollywood actors can't see this. Can't see the decline of Disney through their own eyes. Okay. Disney is a dying company. Okay. Disney is a dying company. Okay. Disney is losing money every quarter. Okay. That's why Disney is trying to get Taylor Swift fans to watch Disney. Okay. That because they they are paying. Okay. They're paying. They're giving her money to put her movie. Also, she's making a movie. About the, you know, about the, her new album, to get to make sure it's on Disney platform. Okay, same thing of them paying Fortnite to get, you know, people to watch Disney Plus. It is a desperate move from Disney, and we'll get over that in the next video. But it's this is so desperate that Disney killed the IPs and expects us to ask for a season two. And continuation of the IPs. Okay. Heck. The sequel trilogy is the only Star Wars trilogy. To decline on its third entry. That's how bad the sequel trilogy did. When the end, when the last entry in the every Star Wars trilogy. Is supposed to be the epic finale. But the Rise of Skywalker was a pile of garbage. Not as bad as the last Jedi though. But still a pile of garbage either way. So that's about this video here. Goodbye.